therefore any relationship that's going to be successful long term has to support us following our, our highest values, has to support us following our inner guide and has to support the other person living by their highest values and then following their inner guide. So in a sense you could say the purpose of a relationship is to help each person to hear, understand and follow their own inner guide. A relationship will succeed to the extent that allows each person to follow their inner guide and live by their highest values. Because in that way each person will feel that they're fulfilling their highest potential. I suspect that relationships that go on long term and are successful long term are those in which the couple discover something beyond romantic love and one way or another make a commitment to the highest and best within each of them and giving scope to each of them to develop and grow in their following of their inner guide. Now following our inner guide doesn't mean following every whim or notion that comes our way. There's a certain amount of maturity required in learning to follow our inner guide. Genuine promptings from the inner guide tend to lead the person towards serving a purpose greater than themselves. They don't tend to lead somebody to simply switching their partner because they want somebody better looking or with more money or whatever. They tend to lead a person towards serving others in some way, to doing something worthwhile and beneficial with their lives, not only within their immediate circle but outside of that circle too. <laughs>